natural ways to heal anxiety. Um, these are 10 things I do before I think about medication. And I don't prescribe benzos because once you start them, they're really hard to stop. This comes from my book, The End of Mental Illness. I love it. The first thing I do for anxiety is I check for hypoglycemia, um, anemia, low iron, and hyperthyroidism. So if you're chronically anxious, have your primary care doctor check your labs because if you have low iron, you're anxious. If you have high thyroid, you're anxious. If you have low blood sugar, you're anxious. Um, I eliminate artificial dyes, preservatives, and sweeteners from your diet because sometimes even red dye number 40 can make you anxious for no reason. Um, I put my patients on an elimination diet for a month, eliminate gluten, dairy, corn, soy, artificial dyes, and sweeteners. 30% of your symptoms will go away if you get rid of uh, crap in your diet. Um, practice, prayer, meditation, hypnosis, they're incredibly powerful and they have no side effects. Heart rate variability, training, companies like HeartMath, um, amazing, it's sort of like meditation, biofeedback, and is very powerful. Diaphragmatic breathing in a very specific pattern. Four seconds in, hold it for a second, eight seconds out. You do that just 10 times, your anxiety is gonna begin to dissipate. Um, eliminate the ants, especially the fortune-telling ants where you're always predicting the worst. Whenever you feel sad, mad, nervous, out of control, write down what you're thinking, and then ask yourself, is it true? Now, you may be saying to yourself, but a pill is so much easier. Yes, a short-term fix that has serious long-term problems. Do the work, it'll benefit you for the rest of your life.